Alrighty, since I'm already here, I'd like to give a short review of this cleansing spa water from Kogendo or Kogendo. What is the real pronunciation of this one? I'd like to call it Kogendo. It's a Japan product as usual. This is like a bioderma since this has been compared to bioderma a lot. But I think they do have some sorts of similarities but I can't really compare the them. The only thing that I can tell is that they're both water and this Kogendo Dancing Spa Water, it claims that it has natural herbal essences using its Zumo Natural Spa Water, oil-free and mildly acidic. The mildly acidic part I am not so sure because I didn't really feel any irritation when I first used it's it. It's just water. The and same feeling with Bioderma. You know, it's just like, you know, the normal cleansing where in you, you, you don't need to rinse your face. For example, you're very, very tired coming from work and of course you have to remove your makeup and you're too lazy to chuck your bum to the toilet and you can wash your face. So you can just, you know, use Bioderm or this one. For me, even if, you know, how tired I am, I still use this and I still wash my face. So. I, I, I just cannot sleep without washing my face. It also says it, here it's rinse-free, oil-free and safer contact lens wear no artificial colors, fragrance or petroleum based mineral oil that is really good, there's no mineral as oil as you know Japan products are really well known and they're really really good it's just like my SK2, they produce um, good quality products and I don't know, I'm really sorry if I've been comparing this to Bioderma because a lot of people have been really comparing the two but it really depends on, you know, on your on your preference. I mean, they're both water, uh, water-based or you know, cleansing spa water. Some use those normal makeup remover that you can just easily purchase. And I've also been using that before they asked me to try this one, and I don't think I can compare them because they're both the same. It works fine for me. Yep. Now, so I will like use this before I wash my face. So I have <laughs> cotton pads here from, of course. Move and pick. Thank you for the sponsorship. <laughs> pick off my cotton. No, bag. seriously. It's very easy on how to use this. Just a normal one. Oh. Same way that I apply my. Oh, really nice. It's not the cheap one. So you, you can see. It's not really the typical cotton, um, you know, that some hotel provides. Uh, oh, this is really good. So what I do is I just, you know, roll it here. Um, around my middle finger, just like that, and then you take this one, and then you just drop it like this. Basically, do this one, and then it depends on where you want to put it. So for me, I usually put on the forehead first, just like that. You know, just normal cleansing. So today I didn't really put a lot of makeup. I just have my eyebrows and you know um. BB cream, just um, powder, and as you can see, I'll show you later. So, you can also do this one, but for me, I am used to like doing this, I don't know why. So, yeah, oh, well, as you can see, ta da, that's how dirty my face is now. This is the makeup and not really bad and I haven't actually cleansed my eyebrows yet so yeah it's like it's normally you know the feeling is just like dipping a cotton pad in water and you know cleansing your face with with the same yeah so I also love that it has like a little of a citrusy friend to it. Friend? What? Where did it come from? Citrusy smell <laughs> to it. Maybe because of the. <laughs> There's no fragrance here, so I don't know where, where, did, it, where did it come from. Um, maybe from ginger root extract, because I've read the ingredients and. There's some ginger thing in particular over here and in a rosemary as well. I wonder if it smells really good. So I'll try to remove my eyebrows. Yeah. Very good. 
So in case I have like eyeshadow, I just I just do this, you know, you just of course do the same thing, I just also do that. Like that and then dip and then you just press it like that for about five to ten seconds and just swipe. That's about it. But then again I don't really depend on cleansing spa water or the bioderma one when I remove my eyeshadow because of course there's still a need for those um, makeup or eye makeup remover, you know, those really um, made for eye makeup remover, especially waterproof ones because it's really hard to depend on water-based makeup remover. For I'm me. gonna wash my face in a while and I'm gonna um, apply my mask, my Kiehl's mask and show you how I apply it. 